Hello. Hi, Michael. Hi, how are you? I'm fine, how are you? Oh, not too bad. So, today's lesson... I can't hear you. Sorry? I cannot hear you. You can't hear me. Hmm. Yeah. Now, yeah, now it's okay. It was, now it's, was it okay now? Can you hear me? Yeah. yeah. Okay, good, awesome. All right, so today's lesson is about human body vocabulary. Now, most people know the basics, right? But you know what, I want to kind of get people, once they come in, to, to kind of confuse them or, you know, to ask them which this connects to that to see if they know what body part I'm talking about. So I'm not going to get into scientific body parts or, you know, stuff like that because I don't think anyone is a doctor or it's just going to be really confusing. So to start off with the list, uh, hmm, what, what do you think uh, your ab abdomen, you know where that is? What? Abdomen. No, what is it? No guess at all. No. Not at all. It is your stomach. Okay, can you, could you write this down? Because uh, abdomen, this is stomach, okay. Yes. Yeah, I see. If so, some, I, I didn't know this. So if someone says uh, something about your abdomen, they're talking about the stomach. Uh-huh, okay. Adam's apple. Now, I'll tell you this. Only men have an Adam's apple. I know, I know, I know, because it, we have the same in, in Russian and Ukrainian language. It's uh, like the thing that is uh, like like a throat or something like this. Right? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. so uh, do, do, you have, uh, some other, do you have some other name for this uh, part, um, part of the body? Well, no? it's, it's right here, so it, it's your voice box, I guess. I don't know, lyr not lyrics, I don't, I don't know what you would call it. Some people call it the voice box, but if I look up another, uh, an, an, another name, I don't know, I always call it an Adam's apple, but Adam's uh, apple, other, other name. Is there an other name for this? Uh, mm. Yeah, because it, even the multitron is a, a huge dictionary. It gives only one uh, thing, Adam's apple. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. It, it also gives well, like well, some well, medical medical um, uh, term, like laryngeal prominence. Yeah. What is it? It's your voice box. Yeah, like this. It's what gives your voice. No voice. Yeah. <laughs> You're not going to be talking there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, yeah right. Autonomy. I guess it's the same in Russian, isn't it? Yeah, it's just the same. Anatomy. Sorry, what was it? autonomy? What are we talking about here? Anatomy. So we can say like the anatomy of, uh, you know, different parts of the body, right? We're talking about the, the specifics, the scientific parts. Yeah. Uh, this bone connects your foot and leg together. Uh, what, what does it connect? Your foot and leg together. I don't know. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. How are you? Oh, I'm great. <laughs> How are you? I'm okay. So you, you just... You got me and Yvonne, we're trying to figure, well, I, I know the answer, but we're about body parts, uh, trying to figure out what connects the leg and foot together. Uh, neck, neck and no, foot? No, 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 leg, 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 oh, sorry. Leg, leg. leg. and foot. Uh, wristle. What? No, what? Uh, uh, oh, not, not, not wristle, uh, like... Um, а что, а как на русском это будет, Таня? Сейчас, то я пытаюсь да, хоть на русском это вспомнить, как щика, щиколотка, нет? Щиколотка. I don't know, Michael. Well, uh... Nobody knows going once, twice, three times, nobody? All right. It's your ankle. Uh, and. Oh, I'm great. And how are you? Okay. Ankle. Ah, okay. Ankle, ankle. So, you just... So, no, yeah. Andy. It is your ankle. Uh... Oh, here's another one. Uh, you know what? Uh, here's you know what? Uh, okay, hmm. how do I say this? Uh, some people they need to get it removed because it gets ruptured. Does anyone know what, what ruptured is... means? No. 
when like something explodes and ruptures. Ruptures. Can could you write uh, all those those words uh, down? Rupture. It's like explosion or what? Yeah, yeah, a rupture. Oh, there's only one P. My bad. One P. Made a little boo boo. All right. Sure. So it, it it okay. You guys know this because it happens to some people, right? Even in Ukraine. So, uh, you have it in your body, and you don't really need it, and sometimes it needs to get removed because it ruptures, and nobody knows what it does. Uh, appendix. No. Appendix. Bingo. 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 Yes. Appendix. Uh, okay. Okay. Now, what the heck is, why do we need an append? I don't know, what, what does an appendix do, do, do? What does it do? Does anyone know? Maybe something like something that is connected with our immune system to protect our immune system, something like that. I I don't think that yeah, I think that it gathers all the small parts, uh, for example, uh, ashes, how can say семечки. Oh, no, шкарлуки от семечек. You're talking like from air particles, or I don't understand what... No, no, no. The particles, the little семечки. Сейчас мы узнаем, как будет семечки. Is there a doctor in the house? Doctor house? No. Sunflower seed. Скорлупа шел. Скорлупа шел. A shell of the sunflower seeds, for example, right? Like little... Particles Sounds and uh, okay, all right. Yeah, and it's like it uh, prevents it from like uh, going to some other parts of the body. No. Okay. How? Bread. So it gives your voice. No voice. You're not gonna be talking, right? Um. Uh, uh, who's this new per the new person who came in? I'm sorry, I can't read the name in Russian, isn't it? Pavel. Pavel, yes, Pavel. Hello, hello. How do you say your name? Because I, I can't read you. Hello. Like hello. Of, uh, hello. 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 You can participate any time. I'll, I'll call out random people as well. So the next, okay. So what happens if you don't have an appendix? Does anything? I mean, will you die? Well, what will happen to you? Nothing. You you can lead a normal life, I think. Yes, <laughs> many people sleep without hands, legs, uh, and I think without appendix they can live too. Well, why does it rupture? Does anyone know why it? it Ruptures. Nobody knows. Because you have very bad habits of uh, food, <laughs> food bad habits. I can say uh, a lot of fast food if you eat and something like that. Oh no, no McDonald's, no McDonald's. <laughs> yeah. Uh, here's another one. Uh, hmm. This you, this part of the body, it's uh, it's on the foot, and it usually it's. Uh, it's a, it's a, it's the back part of the foot. Does anyone know what we can call that? The back part of the foot. Back part of the foot. The back part. There's a front part and there's a back part. Five. Ah, uh, нет. Uh, heel. Heel is one. Or ball of the foot. Ball of the foot. <laughs> ball. Yes, yes. Like a ball, right? Uh, heel. Heel dog. You know, we can say heel dog. Have you ever heard of heel dog? You, you know what, when you say, like, you look, you said heel, right? Mm -hmm. You can also say heel to a dog. Do you know what that, that means when you say heel dog? Anyone know? No. You sit. You should die. Mm -hmm. You want your dog to sit. You say heel. It's like a dog, right? Maybe. Or something. Heel? Well, the dog is a dog, right? Heel. This this part connects. This part connects your shoulder and your hand together. Shoulder and hand. 
Yes. Плечо. Как оно будет по-английски? Maybe shoulder and wrist together. Wrist. Arm? Your arm. His arm? That's your arm. Now, oh. speaking of shoulder, whoever got a dislocated shoulder? Has, is this, is this, has anyone have, ever had a dislocated shoulder? Does anyone know what that is? Dislocated? It's like break shoulder. Uh, Broken. Not broke. Yeah, when the uh, shoulder comes out of the socket. Oh, so it's a you know what a socket is like. Yes, yes, yes. It's it's a wiv. I got it. Wiv. Yeah, yeah. So let's. Uh, just want to know if anyone has that. Then that can be very painful. Very painful. Um, this wiv. It's a wiv. Sorry. No, no, no. I'm just talking with myself. <laughs> All right. Okay. So uh, every toe on your foot is different. What do we call the largest toe? The largest toe? Largest. What, what do we call the largest uh, toe? Does anyone know? What's a proper name for it? Like big, big one. No. Big toe. The we big call it big toe. Yeah, so no Can one's gonna. The, foot? the big toe. That's an actual name, the big toe. It's the biggest. It's the biggest toe. Big toe. Oh. Big toe. And any ideas? What is it? Sorry. Any ideas? What is it? Your big toe is the biggest toe. Oh. The largest toe. No, oh, it's like a uh, thumb, big thumb. It's the first. It's the first toe of your foot. Это первый первый палец на ноге, вот самый большой. Разве не finger? Is uh, finger это на на руке. Oh. Feet. Feet. Different names for. Uh, Michael, is it right that we call in toe uh, on the foot and finger on hands? Yes. Oh, okay. Finger. Yeah, right. Fing wait 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 finger for uh, for hands right and uh, toe for feet. <coughs> so no one can give you the middle toe. Yeah. <laughs> Anyone understands what we're doing there? Maybe yeah. the little bit. But yeah, if someone drives with their uh, their feet. All right. Uh, a lot of people don't know what this. I I can't. Okay. Uh, this. Uh, Michael, we have Dmitri and his microphone is turned off. Oh. Uh, Dmitri, uh, у вас микрофон выключен. Там вверху есть настройки. Посмотрите. I, I love um, Ah, okay. Oh. Okay. Dimitri. Hi. Hi. I can say your name correctly because it's in English. Okay. Uh, okay. Bladder. What's a bladder? Does anyone know? A lot of people don't know what this is. What? Oh, I know what it is. It's a uh, uh, very fat girl has uh, bladder on his. Uh, uh, mm. It holds something. What does it hold? Hold? It holds something. It's a big sack. Well, I don't know. I haven't never been there. But well, it's a bladder. Bladder is a bladder in Russian. Bladder. It holds something. What does it hold? Anyone? Dimitri? He, anyone? No ideas. <laughs> well, hmm. Okay. We have to. How do I say this without giving the answer? Uh, we need to. I don't know. I'm just gonna say it holds. I, I understand what you're talking about. Yeah. 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 If you drink a lot of water, right? Yeah. Then you want to go to the toilet, and uh, everything that is uh, uh, where where comes every all the water that you drink. Reservoir. <laughs> Call it the reservoir. What does a reservoir do? What's a, what do we have a reservoir? It holds what? Some, a reservoir. Some liquid. Some liquid. All right, so we can say the bladder is a reservoir. Right? It holds liquid. Well, it holds urine. Okay. Um, what else can we say? Oh, yeah. All right, you talk. Yeah. And for blood, I mean, we have blood that goes through our body, right? I said to uh, Ivan, it's not blood, it's borscht. You know, I thought that was funny, right? But okay. what are those things? That goes through our body. What it's called? It's not veins. It's something else. Does anyone know? 
Vessels. Blood vessels, yeah. Vessels. 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 But why do we call it vessels? Does anyone know why we call it a vessel? No. No. Noise. Any idea? No, no. Vessel, because it's an opening. Your your blood, the, the, it's a, a it's a, it's a it's a tube, right? A tube is, is an opening, so it's a vessel. Okay, we call it's a right? mm -hmm. All right. Vein, right? Or no? Sorry. Uh, blood vessels. It's the veins, right? No. It is the veins, and I was explaining why. I asked anyone if they knew why they called a vessel, and and they didn't ah. know. So they said it's because it's, it's an opening. Hole. Not a hole, but like a, a tube. You know what? They're tubes, right? All right. Ah, here's a good one for you. Uh, usually, okay, so how do I how do I say this? Uh, we call this a baby cow. What do we call a baby cow? Baby Any idea in English? Baby what? Baby uh, cow. Moo, a cow. Oh, okay, baby cow. What it's do we call it? There's a name for a baby cow. Dimitri. Anyone? It, it, this is part of body? No, 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 no. First up, it's, it's an animal. Okay? Yeah, I, I want to know. The, 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 the answer I give you will give you the answer of what I'm talking about. So, what do we call a baby cow? The animal, the cow? Nobody knows? In Russia, I know. <laughs> Cube? No. no. What? 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 Cube? No. Cow. 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 No, uh, kafir. All right. So, where where do you think the calf is on the body? Where is it? Where is it? Not. I'm not talking about the animal now. I'm not yeah, talking about. I understand. The it's a very strange question. <laughs> um, on the toma? No. Oh, I hope not. <laughs> Dimitri, any idea? Um, uh, on the leg. And the leg, where, where, what bones are connected? A what? What bones are connected? You said on the leg, but that's not really pers that's not really accurate. Can you tell me what bones are connected to the calf? It's like knees. No, knees are knees. <laughs> Going once, th your foot and leg connect the calf. But why it, it calls like calf? I don't know, that's English. Okay, what what uh, what it consists of? I don't know. Like some people have big calves, some people have small calves. It's some muscles. It's bone. 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 It's a 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 back. Я смотрю, что это голень. Ну да. Ага, окей. Окей, Майкл, we understood what you're talking about. We can't explain it in English, but we know what it is in Russian. You you can take uh, Michael, you can take your cat or your rabbit and show to us all the parts of the body <laughs> then of the of the animal. <laughs> but they will scratch me. That rabbit has sharp claws now. Ah, okay. Very sharp. And Chester will Scratch me too. He has nice claws too. Um, what? Is, okay, I don't know how to say this. I, you know, when you're eating chicken or something like that, sometimes you get the you know, like this bad stuff of the chicken when you're eating. Any any idea? I'm trying to explain this the best. What what this is? What you're eating? Not the most tasty part. Most tasty part? Oh. Not tasty. You obviously, you don't uh, not the bone. It's the not tasty. Not taste. Oh, neck. I think for me. Okay, that you have a point, but no, it's not the neck. It could be in the meat. Sometimes you find this in the meat. Yeah, I see. It's not anyone. Tanya, I got your name right oh. there. 
I don't know what uh, maybe cartilage. Cartilage. Any idea what cartilage is? Cartilage. No. No. <laughs> you find it in your joints. What's a joint? Look. It's a friash. It's a joint. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah. Right? So. But someone's very like this part of uh, chicken, you know? Who? <laughs> uh, <laughs> me, for example. <laughs> <laughs> I, I see. Well, dogs like it. Dogs love it. Dogs eat bones. Humans don't eat bones. Look on the Discovery Channel. Lions eat everything. I think it depends on the different culture, I think. Well, I never found it tasty. I don't know, but I don't know. It's just, <laughs> just sometimes you know, it's it's like and it's it's uh, not like very tasty, but it's uh, very um, interesting to do it. I I I don't, cannot explain. It's like eating bones in a fish that we have in Ukraine. You know that real bony carp fish. I, mean, I, I try to remove every one. Uh, another one here. Ah. Uh, it's this part is somewhere it has two parts and it's on your head. And it's on both sides of your face. It's on both sides of your face. Cheeks. Jeez. Your cheeks. What? How many people knew that? Dimitri, did you did you do you know what your cheeks are? What is cheeks? Oh sure. you said it. But sure. You Who? Oh, sure. Yeah. Cheeks. Cheeks, yes. Yeah. Cheeks. My cat has nice cheeks because I feed him raw chicken. Okay. Um, let's see. Oh, this is also on your face as well, and it's sometimes for some people it's very pointy. Pointy? Pointy. What's what is pointy? Uh, very rackles or something like that. What? Uh, rackles. No. Forehead. A point, a pointy forehead. Uh, ah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, uh, eyebrows. Eyebrows. A point. <laughs> what kind of makeup are chin, we? Uh, it's chi is it ch ah chin or broad? Chin, chinny yeah. chin chin. You know, some some people have a, a dimple here. You know, like a. I don't know how. To uh, how, how, how to spell it? Uh, the can you write it? What is chimpo or, or dimple? Dimple here, you know, like uh, dimple. Dimple. Uh huh. Yes. Yeah. A like small hole. Yeah, small hole. Yeah, it's me. Yeah, yeah. Chevy Chase. You remember Chevy Chase, the actor? It's a, a little dimple there. So I don't know. I don't know. I know some people like. Uh, there's an actor who has a real long chin, or he, he's he's a very famous person. Does does anyone know who he is? He's, he's very famous for this. Uh, I know Tarantino. Right? Who? No, Tarantino. Tarantino. Yeah, the dimple. <laughs> Jane Leno. Ah, Jane Leno. Oh yeah, same, right? Right. This next bone. God, you have to be a boneologist. I don't know what you call a boneologist, anyways. Uh, this another one. It's on your chest. And again, there's two sides of it. And uh, people break this bone sometimes uh, if if they get like into sports accidents. Uh, Ribers. Uh, on your chest. Oh, on your rib ribers. No. Uh, ribbon. Ribbon. Oh, did I hear ribbon? No, 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 no. <laughs> it's on your upper chest, and I don't know what it does, but it it it's part what? of the upper what upper upper chest. You have a lower chest. It's a bone. Collar bone. Collar bone. Right? Collar bone. You say collar bone, didn't you? Yeah. So why why do you think they call it a collar bone? Collar bone. Коралловая кость? Не, колор, как... Это как воротник. Не, как колор, как... 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 Не, как колор, как...
Polar. It, you would say, like, if I'm pronouncing it, polar, but it's color. Like, color. I don't want to confuse people now, but color. Color bone. Color. Dimitri, okay. any idea why we call it a collar bone? Because there is, uh, we wear a collar. We what? We wear a collar. Who wears a collar? Sorry, I'm lost. <laughs> Because of its location, maybe it's near yeah. when we wear some blouses with uh, colors and. That's so why. you say co color, but you say like you wear it. A, what? what hmm. Okay. Uh, on animals, how how do you how do you put, where do you put the identification on animals to identify them? On a collar. On, on a neck. Collar. neck. Neck. Right. We uh, call it a collar. You know that thing around the neck? Ah, uh, shame. We call the collar. Mm -hmm. Who has an animal here? Who has an animal? Yes. Pet? Cat or dog? Tanya, do you have an animal? No, no pets. <laughs> Dimitri? Mm, yes, but it's uh, without color. So why don't Ukrainian people, Russian people, what, I mean Eastern Europe, why don't they put, uh, do, do they believe in this, call, putting collars on their pets, or is this an Americano thing? Maybe it's for uh, very rich people who has uh, very... For very rich people. Well, what do so? What do we put on the collar? Does any what do we put a uh, collar on our dog? Does anyone know? Uh, a, name, a name of a pet and uh, a name of a uh, host uh, of the pet. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what about? I'm just kind of curious. Does anyone in Ukraine do 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 we? Does there like a service uh, identification to put like a a chip on on your your pet's uh, on your pet's neck? Do we have this service? No. 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 Oh, okay. So what? What happens? Nice idea. What happens if you lose your pet? Will someone actually call? Like, uh, you know, you know, that's the thing. Like, like in Canada, uh, they like if if you get your pet lost, right? Someone takes it to the vet, and they have a scanner, and they scan it, and they look for the chip. If it has a chip, they can tell you where it, where the where the pet where the owner is. Because if you have a pit bull in Canada. Oh, a okay. cool business idea for Eastern Europe. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So if you have a pit bull in, in uh, like in Canada and it has no owner, they will destroy it. Like, done. No more. Finished. Uh, this service in Ukraine is uh, finding and uh, destroying un homeless animals. It doesn't work. Yeah. Uh, These homeless animals just uh, live and run around. Oh, they like to chase me, believe me, I have my run -ins. Anyways, moving on. Uh, this other part, it, it connects as well, it connects your lower arm and upper arm together. R Rizal, yeah? No, it's Rizal. No, upper and lower. Uh, upper. Elbow. Upper, upper, upper. Okay. Sometimes uh, we hit this bone and it really, really hurts. Let a look at Mm -hmm. it. It's called a funny elbow. It's elbow. Yes. Oh, oh yeah, it's very hard. When it is. Elbow. But we call it a funny bone. Is any idea any idea why we call it a funny bone? Funny bone? Yeah. Because when someone's heart it it's very funny, I think, no? Yeah, yeah that's that's the thing. <laughs> oh no, it's not funny. It's not funny, I know, I know, but they call it a funny bone. I kind of like, what's a funny bone? I have no idea. Uh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, just looking here. Ah, uh, um, when we when we blink, does everyone know what it means to blink? My God, blink, 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 blink your, your eyes, right? <laughs> what do we call that piece of skin that's on there? Does anyone know what we call that? In English, please. <laughs> this is English. Eyelid. 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 Why do we call it a lid? Does it, did, 
there's a reason why they call these names. There's a reason behind everything. Does yeah. everyone know what a lid means? No. On a container. Look, see this? Right? For cleaning LCD yeah. screens. Oh, fuck. It's a lid. It goes up and down. The lid opens, the lid closes. All right? So your eyelid is two. It's a lid. It opens and closes. Make sense? I cover it makes sense. <laughs> I cover it, yeah. <laughs> uh, how do I say this? Okay. Usually, this is dead on your body. It does not live. Oh, uh, nails? Specific. Nails, I'm looking for. What nails? More specific. Uh, hair. No. Oh, what? What else? <laughs> this uh, all what is dead in my body. Fingernail is the proper term, not just nail. You have to say fingernail. Oh, I need to say fingernail. Yes. Okay. Proper. Some people use slang and they just say nail, but properly, it's fingernail. Okay, okay, let well, be fing fingernail. But uh, it is correct answer. Nail. I'm trying to use. Correct, correct. You know, I don't, I'm not trying to use English. I don't teach English slang, right? So you can know it, but I, I don't like to teach it because it's not proper. So just say fingernail. Um, this part, this bone is also in your leg as well. It's in your leg. And it's a pretty important bone, and sometimes it snaps. Sugar bone, no? Oh, 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 oh. what did you say? Sugar bone. Sugar? Yeah. What the heck, sugar? What, what, sugar? What's my name? Question though. Sugar bone. I'm just trying to translate Russian to English. Uh, maybe. Yeah, we have such kind of expression like sugar bone. like a sugar bone. What is a sugar? Why do, why do they call it sugar? Oh, it's just a translation. Okay. It's su no, no, it's sugar because it's very um, sweet. Хрупкая. Ah, хрупкая, хрупкая, хрупкая. Я не знаю, как будет. No, it's not the sugar bowl. It, uh, mm, because it's fragile, uh, fragile, хрупкая. Fragile, yeah, ah. because you, it's very simple to broke the, broken them. Okay, this happens if you like fall off a ladder. Does anyone know? Anyone fall off a ladder before? Sure. No, nobody? It is your fibula. Fibula, oh. Something similar. Fibula. It's Latin. How will Latin be in English? You can say exactly what we're talking about. Exactly. All right. It's like a medicine term in Latin. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, the next one here, this is part is also part of your face and it's probably well I would say your upper face as well and uh, you can usually tell people's expressions by looking at this part if they're angry or if they're sad or they're happy eyebrows well that too but no what? forehead <laughs> uh, whoa, 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 whoa. forehead Forehead. Forehead. Yeah. Okay. So what? what can you tell by someone's forehead? What What can you tell if it has like wrinkles on it? What does that mean? It means it is a, pe a person is surprised or something, or if he if uh, he or she is angry or something. Yeah, they they got some some interesting lines on their forehead. Uh, this part is in part of your teeth, and your doctor says to always brush them if they bleed. In your mouth. These? No. <laughs> That's too easy. Tongue? Good, but no. Close, but no cigar. <laughs> Any idea? Sometimes people get an infection here. No? Oh. Uh, throw No, close, but no cigar. Uh, They're pink. What? They're pink. Pink? Pink. 
Dimitri. No idea, sorry. Tanya. No idea, I don't. Miguel. This one, eh? And it's not you. Sure, what, what, what? Huh? No, 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 no. Going once, twice, three times. Yvonne, you're not saying anything, so I'm going to say it. I don't know, I don't know. Your gums, your gums. No, but gums. Это дёсна ещё. А, дёсна, дёсна, да? Дёсна, дёсна. Now, I got a question. How often do Ukrainians go to the dentist, stomologist? Is this like in Canada, they say every six months. Ukraine? No. We also have such, uh, uh, such rules that uh, a person should visit a dentist uh, two times a year, but uh, it's uh, a very seldom situation when we, <laughs> we go to the dentist. Yeah, yeah. So does the dentist say brush your gums or they don't say this at all? Do they ever say that? Hmm? Brush your gums. Never say that? You doc we have, uh, we have uh, an advertisement on our TV uh, about uh, a special toothbrush which can uh, brush your gums. With, uh, so why, do you, why do you think it's important to brush your gums? Dimitri, anyone? What are you doing? I think it's not important. <laughs> you don't think it's important? Yeah. It's very important. Your gums can bleed. Uh, you, 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 you brush your gums uh, so that to strengthen them because you don't want gum disease. Gum disease is a very big problem, actually. So, just a mm. notice there. Maybe because I don't have some like this problem. No, but. You know, like it can it can develop in anyone when you get older. People, you know, I don't know. Just the gum disease is a. I know it's a big problem in, in, in the world. Okay, this part of the body it filters out the alcohol. <laughs> liver. Your liver. We liver. have a yeah. We have your liver. I'll try to pronounce it liver or liver. Lever would be lever, right? Lever. But lever, you know, like in, in Russian, Ukrainian, how you read it is how you say it, but le, no. lever. Huh? Who said what? All right, anyways. Lever, le, live, like live. You know, to live, right? Live, er. And you got the er at the end from the R. Yeah. All right, so yeah, your liver filters out. Uh, well, I guess from your blood, right? Uh, what else? What else? What else? Oh no, I can't ask this. Too personal. You gotta watch what I say here. Uh, this. How do you say this? Okay. Hmm. Uh, if you didn't have feelings, any type of feelings, you wouldn't have this. Huh? Like, how do I say this? If you if I hit someone and they didn't feel this, they would not have that. Uh, no. Nerves. 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 Watch how you say it. So we pronounce it nerves. I don't know how you said it before. But... All right. And I'm trying to go through um, one sec. Okay. This part of the body, it protects your vital organs. The bone that protects your vital organs. Uh, scalp? No. More than one. Riber. Ribers? No. Watch how you say things. Ribra. Ribra, да? Ribra, только как правильно произвести. Ribs. 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 Ah, ribs. 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 Anyone have ribs? Pork? Shushlik ribs? Eh? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Ukrainians, I don't think they like to eat. I guess they like to eat different type of ribs, but usually in eggs. Yeah, it's very tasty. Yeah. Um, going on. I'm just trying to get some, some stuff. Okay. Uh, people who can't walk, usually something happened to this part of their body. 
Cannot walk. Cannot walk. Не могут ходить. Leg? Brain? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> It's not so easy, yeah? No. Um, it's Ooh. long. What? It's long. Fine. It's long. Long. Oh, yeah. long. And it has uh, discs in it. Ah, pas well, it's pin. It's pin. Oh, you fine. 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 Yeah. Spinal what? It's long. <laughs> spine is just an area of the spine, but the Bad whole. Camera. No yeah. idea? It's clear, it's clear. So what is Spinal cord. Vertebra. Spinal cord. It goes from the top vertebrae all the way down to the lumbar, to the bottom where your tailbone is. Oh, wait a minute, I was going to say tailbone. Everyone knows what a tailbone is? No. Tail? No. Oh, yeah, Kopchuk. Tailbone. Oh, tailbone. Does anyone know? How do you break your tailbone? Does anyone know how? How to break it? Yeah. Does anyone know who anyone who broke their ta uh, uh, their own tailbone? Mm -hmm. I remember um, I have very strong hit of my ball. It was very very uh, bad, <laughs> but uh, I, it's, it is not broken. No, but if you fall on your butt, <laughs> you might break your tailbone. That's one way to actually break it. Oh. Um. Uh, someone actually it happened. They fell right on their behind, and they broke their tailbone. So it takes a uh, it takes a long time for that to heal. A long time. So for anyone who has ever had that done. Uh, when we're referring to the body, this is a large part of, of the body, and I see it in a lot of not magazines, but a lot of I would say online internet uh, articles. It refers to, it includes your chest, uh, your stomach, your shoulder, well I guess your shoulder blade. It's, it's commonly used in articles when someone got shot in this specific region. No idea? No. no. Dimitri? Isn't it called simply body? What? Body. Torso. Ah, yes. Torse. Trunk, maybe. Also, no? Torque. It's torque, no? Torso. I don't know. Torso can, it is like this whole part of the body. And then you got your, your arms that connect to your torso, your legs connect to your torso. Right? Usually. Uh, Sorry? No, no. It's uh, in Latin, torque. Okay, I see. So usually you have body armor. They say if you're going to wear body armor, where do we put it? On our torso. Okay. Trunk? Trunk. A trunk. I don't know. I, I know a trunk of an elephant, but I don't know a trunk. Hobbit. I don't know. Trunk I, too? I never heard of it. Trunk? Trunk, yeah, your trunk. I don't know what trunk is. Like, where I, is it on the on the human body? Where is it? I don't know. I don't know. Trunk is a tool, which is also like a synonym. Trunk is a hobbit. The trunk would be the nose, like an elephant. Yes, it's the elephant nose. <laughs> All right, this part connects your leg to your torso, or your leg. Uh, to your hips. What connects your legs to your hips? S? Um, no. <laughs> <laughs> but I close, yeah? Close. Okay. Uh, oh, no, no, your, your knee. Knee. your knee to your, to your um, torso or your hips. I don't know exactly, but it's around that area. Take a guess, someone. Tanya. I have no prediction suggestions. When we buy chicken, we usually buy this part of the chicken too. We like it. It's a lot. It's very meaty. Hip, and uh, we need to guess uh, bone name. Yes. No, it's not a bone. 
I don't think it's a bone. It's like um, it's just a part of the the leg. You know, usually you buy chicken, uh, chicken legs. No other, no fish. Chicken hips. Chicken hips. I never went to buy. No, no. Die, die. Who said die? Yes. Die. Die. Chicken thighs. Die. I don't know. Anyone know how to say it in Ukrainian? Это, ну да, бедро это так и есть. Это синоним хип. Синоним хип? Ну да, вот идет сейчас. Alright. This is it different. Is it different to things like hip и thigh, or it it is synonym? Hip is upper. Like people who get hip replacement is, you know, like maybe because they walk too much in their life or they they did something. But hip is is that bone. Your hip bone is more up. Up from your thigh. Your thigh. I, I guess you have a thigh bone, and your thigh. It, it refers. I think it, re, it refers to the whole part, just like your leg. You're referring to a whole part, but in that leg, there's other bones. Your thigh is just a connection point. You know, it's it's a big bone actually. The thigh bo thigh is a very big part. Okay. Now, now this part. I don't know how to say this. It's not a bone. It's not a vessel. It it makes up fat. It makes up mus muscle. We have a specific name for it. What else can I don't know. Mix up, you say what? Uh... It, make, it makes up. Sorry, I'm using idioms. Makes it makes it. It creates it. Makes up. It's like connect, no? Uh. If we want to get into science, the, the, the cells duplicate and duplicate to create this. Uh, we have it in skin too. Muscle. Fat. English, because you know I'm not going to understand you probably. I'm just trying to find an answer for my colleague. Dimitri, you, you try to say cell. Yeah, the cells make up usually this. I'm not a biologist here, but you know, I'm trying to. They usually make up to to bunch. create. It's like bunch, no? No. Uh, when people get in a fire, right? They they have a skin graft to create. You know, when you get into a fire and you're, the skin is burnt, they need to create the skin a skin graft, new skin. And they also said, they also say you can't get. Uh, if you want to get uh, more muscle on you, you need, yeah. you need to have more of this. And it's not protein shakes. <laughs> it starts with the T. You use this to wipe your nose sometimes. Fat. Fat. No, T. No, T starts with T. T I. Oh, okay. Uh... No idea. I'm gonna go three times once. Uh, teeth. No. Tissue. Tissue. What is it? It's a tiny. You got muscle it's tissue. It's like abstract. Uh, no. No. You got muscle tissue, fat tissue. The tissue is what makes up the or organism. Oh. Fat tissue. You don't have no tissue. You have no fat. You have no muscle tissue. You have no muscle. А мы так говорим, мы так на русском говорим, мышечная ткань, но вообще говорим. Да, говорим. Ну, это, это медики так между собой обычно общаются, да? Ну, вот такое. All right, so, another part of your finger. What do we call this part of the finger? We have our middle finger. I don't know, this baby finger. We call index, it index finger. Your index finger. Why do we call it the index finger? Any idea? Because we can index in this type of that can show what is what. What is what? Yeah, we point. It's a pointer. They call it a pointer, yeah. It's funny, every 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 finger actually has its own uh, name. Uh, what else here? I'm trying to get another one. Okay, this is also in your mouth and uh, we use this part to go up and down, to move our mouth up and down. Yes. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
jaws. Yeah. How do you break your jaw? What are some ways you can break your jaw? Anyone know how? If somebody hit you, in, in, in your face. if somebody hit you on your face, yeah, you could break your jaw if they hit you hard enough. Just your sneeze. Here. <laughs> okay, sorry, Ide, I'm mixing my Ukraine. Okay, yeah, and uh, well, Yvonne, you said something too? Yeah, if you eat too much, you can break it. <laughs> I like that. That's yeah. very difficult, I think. If Why? you open it uh, to, uh, like, if too you, If you eat up the stick, you can break it. <laughs> too wide, if you open it too wide. <laughs> well, you got your, your lower jaw and your upper jaw. Mm -hmm. There's specific medical terms that... Uh, like an orthodontist would use, but I forget. Well, this is not a medical class, right? So this is not Dr. House, right? Okay. Um, and no one really needs to know that. Ah, your okay. Your your lip nodes. Any any idea where your lip nodes are? Lip what nodes? Lip nodes. Wow. Second word. I I can't. <laughs> Understand. <laughs> oh. oh, it's your rabbit. <laughs> no, no, my cat. My cat. Uh, <laughs> it's your cat. <laughs> sorry, sorry. No, no, my cat. Michael, show us your rabbit. My rabbit? Hold Dimitri on. is silent. <laughs> I, 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 don't, I don't even know where the... It, I, oh, hey, hey. Come on. What, what is his name? His name is Cupcake. Look. <laughs> and just so Cupcake. sweet. <laughs> Okay. Oh, there you go. Come see, come see. Wow. Hello, hello. <laughs> nice. Britanska, да? Порода It's a lion head. Uh, anyways, your lymph nodes are here. You ever feel your lymph nodes here? Ah, uh, lymph. Lymph. Yeah, lymph. I guess I don't know in Ukraine. They call it lymph. 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 I thought it was lymph nodes, no? Nodes. Second, well, I can please uh, spell the second word. Uh, Lip. What? Uh, can you type it? Uh, can you type it? Notes. Notes. Ah, uzli, da, notes. Lips, lips, notes. So we have a lot of notes in our body. There's like, there, I found out there's a lot. And in your chest, everywhere. And yeah. uh, does anyone know what they do? Or no one no one knows what, what lip notes do? They produce uh, limp. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, sometimes you, um, they get bigger. You know, they get really big, and it, it fights, uh, it, like, for bacteria, you know? Mm -hmm. So, uh, it, I found when I was in Ukraine, my lymph nodes were all swollen because it was trying to fight the bacteria. You can you get more? Because there's a lot of bacteria in the air. They produce this white... Um, uh, they produce... Okay, I don't know. I but it, doesn't, it doesn't matter. We are not in medicine class. <laughs> not medicine, not today, not not doctor. Uh, this is also a part of your nose. So a lot of people call it. Uh, it it's a, it's a, it's the upper part of your nose. Does any anyone know what we call this? It's like in your nose. You'll see it. it Yvonne, no, you're listening. Um, I'm, I don't know uh, how to say this in uh, in in English. No, true. Tanya? I don't know it also in English. Like a bridge? No, it's I don't know how to like give you hints anymore. It, nostril. Who said nostril? See someone's genes. Yeah, yeah. Dimitri, you're fast, right on 55, 55. Uh, and you have nostril hairs. So if someone says nostril hairs. It's the hairs in your nose. Oh, this cost it all. <laughs> well, you gotta know, right? I mean, what people are talking about. Yeah, that's that's that. Gotta know. Is there some vocabulary list here that's more? I can't really uh, explain it. It's not really important. Uh, I want to go through a couple of more. I'm just uh, trying to figure out which ones we want. Ah. Uh, usually, if you're playing football, you hurt this sometimes. Sometimes, if someone kicks you in your, you get kicked sometimes here. You know, because when you're playing football, sometimes you don't kick the ball. You kick the other person's leg. Okay, but specific part. Knee. 
No, 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 no. Mm -hmm. Who kicks me in football? I don't think that really happens, does it? Well, she uh, the... If you kick high, maybe, and your hip will knee, right? Or another private parts, too, if you're not. Ankle. Lucky. It's ankle. No. No. Oh. Starts with an S. S? Uh, it starts with an S. Shin. So if you hear someone hits their shin, it's like uh, the part of the leg, the, the front part. Rolling. Oh, it's a uh, sugar bone. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's the sugar bone, maybe. Yeah. Know. Okay, in the part of the your intestine. Oh, please, I just said it. All right, okay, I'm... <laughs> Yeah, I just said intestines. Type it. What do our intestines do again? Type this part of both place. What do the intestines do? I didn't want to say that word, but... What do they do? Intestines. Oh. oh. Someone explain to me in English, what does it do? Mm, I think all uh, food that we eat uh, goes down to this in in ten times. Wait, let's how we how do we pronounce it? Tanya, give it a try. Maybe you can pronounce it. In intensin. Uh -huh. no. No intensin. Dimitri, give the example. Uh, inter inter uh, just intestine. Intestine. I got a tricky word. I Ivan, give it a give it a try. Just. A uh, let me see. Uh, intestines. I don't. In, intestines. 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 Some people say intestines. Some people say intestines. Intestines. Your intestines. You'll hear it very common in North America. So, does anyone know how long your intestines are? Any idea? 12 meters, no. I think. 12 meters, yeah. In, I know in feet. I don't know meters. I know 30 feet. 30, oh. Uh, 30? <laughs> 30. 30. Okay. 30 feet. Yeah, so you got your, your, um, your small intestines and large. It's like 9.1 meters. Hmm. Around there, yeah. So the small intestines they take the uh, the nutrients out from the um, the nutrients from the uh, the food, and the large intestines, well, that's the other um, that's the other area. Um, what about I'm trying to get ah, this is a part of your throat too. It's a part of your throat, and it can well, it's a connection of your throat. Oh. Is there any idea? I know, I know my body very bad. <laughs> so, ah, throat. It's a part of throat, yeah. It is. I'm just trying to give you more specific too. It extends across the bottom of the rib cage. What is rib cage? Это клетка из как реберная клетка из ребер, rib cage, no? No, actually, I made a mistake. Not your throat. It, no, in the bottom of your rib cage. I made a little mistake. I was thinking of something else. It, it's lungs. No, close. What do lungs do again? What do our lungs do? They ah, bronchids. No. Dimitri, anyone? Diaphragm. Ah, diaphragm. No, it's not connect to uh, the uh, how how to say uh, throat and. Uh, I, I said I made a mistake. I said so I was thinking of something else. I mean, I said that. It's at the bottom. Stomach, stomach and uh, th thorax. Yeah. Yes, it extends across the bottom of the rib cage. I, I I pointed that out. I made that small error. That's what I said before. Okay. Okay. I made that small little mistake. That was my little fault. Uh. What, is, what does your diaphragm do? What is it? What's the purpose? Help, helps to breathe, I think. Yeah, it helps it you helps, breathe. Helps you to breathe. Make a breathing. 
Yeah, if, if you didn't have a diaphragm, I don't know how you would breathe. No. Yeah. But why do we have two lungs? No one ever answered that. Why do we have two? Uh, because uh, God loves symmetry. If one fails, second can work. Yeah, I think if, if you have one lung that fails, I think the other one can take over. Is that true? Yes, it's true. And I, I, have, heard, I, I, had, uh, I have uh, some uh, lung surgery uh, three or four months ago. And, uh, and when I w was uh, at the hospital, uh, two guys uh, has uh, lung cat. They left only one lung, and it's a little bit terrible, but uh, pe people can live with one lung. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, no, it's like some people say they can live with the half a brain, I found out too. You know, some people, you know, I heard some girl had half a brain. Uh, what? How? Half a brain. What? I can understand. Half, half of the brain, yeah? Oh, oh, oh my god. <laughs> half of the brain. It, it's oh, very strange. It's very so, strange. How, how, it, maybe it's very one or two guy for all world who can who has this type of uh, living, I think. You know, I don't know, but the, the neurologist said if the other half is not there, the, 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 the brain takes over for the other half. I'm not a neurologist. Ask a neurologist I that question. I think it's like exception. It's not a uh, rule. It's like very, very strange exception. Yeah, but the girl had half a brain and she, she had a very, she was very smart. She was 14. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just telling you something from American news that was maybe maybe seven or eight years ago. Anyways, for our next topic, uh, you know what? Hey, it's good to learn something about the human body that someone didn't know. I could go on for hours, but unfortunately, it would be a medical show, and uh, this is not a medical show. So the next topic will be about uh, vehicle parts. Yes. Vehicle parts. Car from the Mashutka bus. No, you know, from the from the car. So if anyone wanted to understand more about their vehicle, because there's a lot of machina parts that a lot of people don't know about, so it's my job to explain what they are. I'm not going to explain every single one, not because we're not mechanics here. You need, if you are a mechanic or you're interested in aut uh, automobiles, this will be a great class for you as well. And it will be next week. So please, if you're interested, please check it out. Are there any other questions for me? No, thank um, you for the lesson. Как бы сказать порода кошки? Sorry. Uh, I'm sorry. One second, please. Uh, Татьяна, как будет порода по-английски? Порода. Сейчас. Ну, вид spicy, is not. Kind. Uh, what kind? Uh, cat. Your cat is uh, British. Some some kind. Scottish. What? Scottish fold. Ah, breed, breed, порода. Breed. breed. Yeah, yeah, breed. So the your, British is a Scottish. Your cat is, uh, what do you say? Oh. Scottish. Scottish, ah, Scottish, yeah, yeah. Brit British is up, yeah, Scottish down. Oh, I, I don't saw uh, his... Uh, is it somewhere near you, no? No. But they're similar. <laughs> um, you can't breed a, uh, the same cat with the same ears. You don't want to do that. Okay. It's not good for genetics. Very cute. It's very good that you like pets. <laughs> well, you know, in, in, in actually in, the, in America, no, in, in the UK, that cat is worth a couple thousand dollars. Uh, and I even showed Yvonne that that cat in Canada from Alberta, they wanted a thousand dollars for it. One thousand dollars? One thousand dollars. In Ukraine, it's 800 grivna. Well, it was like around a hundred bucks. <laughs> Oh, right. it's a good idea to make a business. <laughs> <laughs> Two businesses now, right? So there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> By the way, we're going to have a class about uh, business ideas and making money, so I'll have to check that out. <laughs> okay. Everyone, it is 10.06. Please check out my vehicle uh, lesson next week. Thanks. Thanks. Next Bye. Week. Okay. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye. Bye.
bye